going to make a fish canvas. So your canvas is just a little bigger than mine, but I'm going to show you how to draw the canvas, uh, draw the fish, and then we will start painting. So you need to have your paints on your side. I have water and a paper towel just to wash my brush. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to draw the fish. So you are going to need a pencil. To draw the fish, fish I like to start off with two circles and they're going to be pretty big. And they're going to be above the center of my paper. And I am going to leave them, they're not going to be attached, just put like a finger in between them. So there are my eyes. So from those eyes, we are going to make our body. So I am just going to connect those eyes with a little rainbow. So that is going to be the top of his head. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect the bottom of the eyes with the U. And that is going to be the bottom of his body. So this fish is dr looking directly at you. So we're going to just see his two eyes, a mouth, and some fins. Next, what we could do is we could make a mouth. To make a mouth, all I'm going to do is make a little heart. We are going to make two fins, a top and a bottom fin. To do the bottom fin, all I'm going to do is make a V. And to do the top fin, I'm going to make an upside down V. To do the side fins, I'm just going to put one line, two line coming out on both sides. And then you could just connect those lines with like a squiggly line almost. And the last bit of detail is in our eyes. I just want you, I want to make those eyes into donuts almost. So I'm going to put another little, a little circle in there. And then around that little circle, I want you to make a little bigger circle. There we go. So then we have a fish with really big eyes. So this is all we're drawing today. So what you could do when you're ready is you could find your paintbrushes and we'll get started painting. All right, so the first step when we are painting it, no matter what it looks like is the outside ring of our eyes, I wanna make white. So we're gonna start with that just because we have a nice clean brush. We want some nice clean white. So I am just going to paint the outside ring of my eyes with that white. There we go. Once I have that, I am just gonna start painting my background. Now my background is going to be blue, but I'm not even going to wash my brush because it's just going to make a little lighter blue if I have some white on it. So you're going to take your time, go around that fish. You can make the background whatever color blue you'd like. You could add a little white to it, you do whatever you'd like. I'm going to add a little white as I'm painting, but take your time and go around that fish.
once I have my background done, I am going to go, now the fun starts to begin. So we're gonna mix a lot of colors. But before we do that, I wanna make my um, fish blue-eyed. So I am just going to take a little light blue. You can make it whatever color you'd like, but I'm just gonna take a little blue and go around that small circle. If you go right over it, that's okay too. I'm gonna go right over it. Eventually we'll add a smaller circle with um, black. But you can make the eyes whatever color you'd like. I'm just doing on blue. I think the light blue is so pretty. All right, so a next step I'm gonna do is I'm gonna find a little cap to my paints and I am going to make green. So I'm gonna put a little blue on it. I already have some light blue on here. I'm gonna put a little bit of blue. Then I'm gonna wash my brush and find some green, uh, some yellow to make some green. So I'm gonna use this color green to paint my fins, but you could really do any color that you want. If you want purple fins, you could do mix a little red and blue, more red than blue. You might add, need to add a little white in there. If you want pink fins, you just mix white and and white and white red to make pink, orange, red, and yellow. So I'm gonna use this green and I'm just gonna do my two outside fins and my top fins. Now you could do, you could also do each fin a different color. It also depends on what you really wanna do. So I'm just gonna do these green. Once again, you could really do them any color that you'd like. For my bottom fins, I'm just gonna add a little more yellow into it. So they're just a little different shade of green. Like a limey green. Once I do that, I'm gonna take my small brush and I'm actually gonna fill in my lips right now. Because my lips, I'm gonna make red, but I'm actually gonna make the body of this fish like a purple, like almost like a magenta. So I'm gonna make it a little purpley. So I'm gonna do my lips first. I'm using my smaller brush to do my lips. And once you're ready, you could start mixing up the color that you'd like for your fish's body. I am going to do a purple, so I'm gonna start with red. Add a little blue in there, see what happens. And a little white. Once you have your color finished for your body, you could start painting your body taking your time going around those eyes and your mouth.
once I am finished with my basic painting, I am, we're going to go back and add some details. First thing I want to do is just so the eyes look a little more normal. <laughs> I'm going to put a little bit of black on my small brush and I'm just going to outline and fill in those circle eyes. And eventually when this black dries a little bit, we'll add a little white reflection. Just like if you did the narwhal, like a little white dot. Then I'm gonna wash my brush and make sure you wash it out really well. We're gonna add some detail now. I'm really, the detail's really gonna focus on those side fins. So what I'm gonna do to those side fins is I'm just gonna add like a little blue and I think some white lines in them. So I'm gonna take blue first and I'm just gonna put some lines of blue. I'm putting four on each side. You could do whatever, like whatever color you do, like whatever like goes with that color. I wouldn't put blue if you did like orange because it would just make brown. But you could put white on top of anything. I'm gonna put some white now. So just to give it a little detail, I'm going to add like a little white reflection line in my mouth. And it might make a little pink if it's still a little wet, that's okay. You can even blend it a little in if you wanna make it a little pink. I'm gonna wash my brush. After everything, I'm just gonna wash my brush out just in case there is a little more paint on it. In my background, I'm gonna add some bubbles. So circle and then a line. And I'm just gonna add a few on one side. Circle and then one line on the same side of each circle. If you have some green left over, I'm actually gonna add a little more yellow to my green. You could add some seaweed on the bottom. So just make some squiggly lines coming up. And as you do it, you could kind of change your green too. You can make it darker. I'm gonna put some more blue in it. Add in a little color on the back bottom. Next, I'm gonna put some white lines just to almost outline my top and bottom fin. And I'm also gonna use the back of my brush, that hard part, and I'm gonna put a white dot in each pupil or the black circle of my fish. At this point, you can add any detail that you'd like. If you wanna add more colors to the body or more details to some of the fins, go for it. You could even add other fish in the background if you have enough room. But I hope you guys had fun learning with me how to draw and paint this fish. Have a great summer.